coincidence the way it lined up. Uh, the talk seemed to have lined up, if you will, in a, what I would call the life cycles of flying a technology, which I thought was another kind of alignment of stars, if I can pick up on this morning's talk. Um, and basically, I guess I would say, I'm sensing that our, our mileage may vary, or the speed with which we're doing deployment, or the way we're attacking it may be varying here. But I thought a lot of things seemed to be lining up, so I would go through real quick and show. We've had three talks. The beginning one back, I think it was 99, if I keep my calendar year straight here, uh, was Wireless Works, and then we had Waiting for Wireless, kind of getting us there. And then last year we had this Wireless Go Prime Time. And I think I can highlight how those topics and actually what was covered seem to align with a lot of the issues at each of the points of the flying wireless that we've gone through. Um, each time when these presentations would go, you can imagine it was the classic, you did a case study, how did I do it, what did I learn? Um, we took a look at other issues. What were the tech tips? What, what, what would I do differently? Well, I did bandwidth on the initiative. Consequences and lessons learned. That's, that's kind of combining more than just the technology uh, or the personnel issue, the tech support, or the equipment, uh, or how it was used, or did it impact the classroom and stuff like that. But I think they tried to go through, if you went and watched the videos again, uh, they came along and said, the consequences of wireless everywhere was any the consequences of having just loners in the, in the library, or the consequences of having proprietary deployment. Uh, with the cost. It's been interesting to also watch the cost go down when the, you can hear obviously in technology the cost go down until, uh, uh, we're getting down to an almost trivial amount. Then uh, last year uh, we had uh, Mitch Davis came in from Stanford and started to uh, talk a little bit more about the what if 